Howdy, 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 everybody. I am Gomer the Ranting Thespian, and welcome back to Blaster Master Zero. We've reached the glacier area where we hope Fred is. Um, whoop. Yeah, red bugs. I don't even like the green bugs. Fuck you, bug. And you bugs, too. Goodbye. Ah, this isn't so icy. But, oh, neither is the water. Oh, no, I can't get up there. Well, that's why we have these little control rooms. <laughs> Like, if you remember, from the, fir from the first um, uh, first thing there, you see that little blue one that says control room? That's what one of these are. They're only in area six. What you do? Go up. And it freezes shit. And you can use the flamethrower to burn it away, too. Was that? Oh! Ah, mm -hmm. uh, yes. Burn the flamethrowers! Those little spinny blades, they only they, they only uh, stay to the ice, and if they find themselves not on ice, they go slow as fuck. Oh, ice with spikes! Melt the spikes away! Flamethrower a day keeps the spikes away. <laughs> and we've already got a map, so let's get out of here. Whee! Stay on the ice, buddy. Just fuck you, spikes. Fuck all this ice. Yeah, if I didn't have to freeze the area in order to pass through, I wouldn't. But, kinda have to. I mean, there are other modes in which you don't have to freeze the water, but unfortunately, for this and for destroyer mode, you have to. Yeah, you wanna try that again? I didn't think so. Ah, one of the most. One of the most fun things you can do with this... Oh, shit. One of the most fun things you can do with this pla this laser. Just go through a whole bunch of these at once. Penetrator. I'm gonna penetrate you. Gonna penetrate you. There we go. That works. Ah, well, that works. Ah, shit. When in doubt, dash across, because when you're dashing, fuck gravity. And we have more. And spikes right behind you. Because that's how that works. Yeah, there's... See these big spikes here? There's two ways to get through them. You could outright destroy them, or you can dash through them. But you can only destroy them with a certain special weapon. Yeah. Yeah, that was delayed, wasn't it? <laughs> ah. Gotta, gotta remember, you're actually on video, Gomer. You need to be, you need to be doing more. Holy shit! And another control room. And hi. Goodbye. Whoop. Ow. 
All right, going to the map. Going straight to the right. Should get me to one room. So let's go over here first. I might be doing a little bit out of order, not a, in an, an, an in optimal unoptimal order. I can English, I swear. Um, but... <laughs> Boom! Denied. Ow. Try it, we'll try it again. Come on, thank you. Goodbye. Alrighty. Let's cut a path. Oh shit. Oh, uh, ow! Don't stand on the spikes, dumbass. Spikes are not for Jasons to stand on. Not even Jason Voorhees would stand on a bed of spikes like that. Maybe. I don't know. Probably not. Ooh. And we have more. More power ups, please. Thank you. Oh! Here we go. Peepers dead. What are peepers? Those are peepers. Strike her up. All right, here we go. Come on. Thank you. Did you see that? Look, okay, pay attention to how it goes bloodshot for like a split second. Holy shit. That is some hellacious red eye, man. Come here. Oh, 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 oh you motherfuckers. Come here. Go away. The cannon shot! Everything's coming up explodey! <laughs> I may or may not have been playing a lot of Overwatch lately. Um, I did record some footage, no no, uh, no talking over it, unfortunately, but... Fuck. Ow. Oh yeah, and... Dash through that, why don't I? <laughs> All you die. Whew. Wait, I could use that. Or attention. Oh. That nah, doesn't matter. Alright, there we go. Oh shit. And up and up. Oof. Sometimes you can't see it, but there's a good reason why you need to freeze areas. Nope, I need you. That was horrible. Could have went a lot better than what it did. And I can't get down there like this because I don't have a wall module. No! That's okay. Jump and whoop. There we go. 
And there you go. Oh, I know what this one's gonna be. I do not like this particular mini boss. But that's what this is. That's where the uh, that's where the decoy is gonna come in handy. Come on, thank you. You are up. once you're on fire, you're already dead. Fuck me. This is not very optimal. Gets to this point. Oh. oh, fuck you. Ah, finally. Ah! Oh, shit. Basically, what this thing was doing. Lock on, and you can just have, well, in my case, it would be Sophia locking on and um, blasting the shit out of everything. Ow. Alright, let's go. We've got one more boss to beat, and we've still got a little bit of story to go through, and, um, yeah. <laughs> oh, is this going to take a little long- oh, this is going to take a little longer, because I will have to backtrack again. Ow, fuck! God damn, that is not my best moment there. Got a little shitter. Oh, we're reaching an area. Ooh, we're getting close to an area. Get up here. Thank you. And you. Yeah, yeah. Come on. Ah! 
potion. Alrighty. Oh, and hey, look, it's Fred. Is that Fred? Drive over. Fred is looking. No, you're not looking too good, buddy. Pretty, pretty poor guy is pretty injured, but he's still alive. Thank goodness. Hmm? What's this? Looks like machine parts. What are these doing here? Jason, can I have a look at him? Yep, he's fine. Sophia is equipped with everything we need to treat him. Seriously? That's awesome. I can't believe we finally found him. And endgame. Nope. <laughs> of course not. What's going on? Hang on a second. Looks like something happened at a facility in there. I guess I'll have to check it out. I'll leave Fred's treatment to you. There we go. We have our froggy. Froggy frog. We got froggy back. Yay! We got a froggy back. Ah, fuck. All right. First time, first time players may not notice this area. I sure, I surely did. And whoop! Oh shit! You got my way, fuckers. Oh, watch this! Ha 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 ha! Oh no! Ice blocks in the floor? What shall we do? Let's blow it up. Oh hey! Life up! Sweet! Now let's go find the. Let's go get take care of the main boss of this area, huh? Oh, get, get the fuck up in there. This one too. Fuck. Oh, and no flamethrower which to take away of the spikes. Oh well. Let's go back to the laser shot until I need something else. Oh shit. Hmm. Oh, that was close. Here we are. I love how it stops on a dime, even on ice. What the fuck? Ow. Asshole. I found something to work with, guys. You know, like... That doesn't help. I'll just go through this way. I don't normally go these ways. It's, I normally just take a more straight shot. Oh, hello! <gasps> yes! That's what I need. <laughs> Anyone wants a <some> barbecue? <laughs> yeah, I'll give you three guesses who I like, who I like to play with, uh, in Overwatch. No. Alrighty, come on. Fully powered up! Aw, oh, yes, son. Ah, technically I could have just went straight down in the other room, I think. Yeah, but that's alright. I have my ways I like to do things. I'm sure you do too. <laughs> uh, alrighty. 
boss time! This is supposed to be the control facility for the glacier area, but it looks like there's nothing here. Get a room full of turrets, dude! Watch out, Jason. I'm detecting a mutant in that room. I think this entire room is a mutant! Looks like there's a lot of them, but they aren't gonna stop me. <laughs> the Forbidden Weapon. Ancient Freeze! Here we go! Fire off one and... Yes! That, this is where the striker really comes in handy and shines. Come on. Thank you. No, 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 no. Fuck you. Oh, there's just one. Ooh! Damn it! I lost a gunpowder level, too. And, of course, those power-ups are going to go away. Watch. Yep. Damn it. The wall climb! Great job, Jason. Are you alright? You're not injured, are you? I'm a little... I'm a little cooked, but I'm okay. Nope, no injuries. All good here. <sighs> Thank goodness. I have something I want to talk to you about when you get back. Got it. Heading back now. I'll be waiting for you. <laughs> Alright, here we go. Story time. So you had something you wanted to talk to me about? Before I do that, Fred, go over and sit with Jason. Fred was sitting in the palm of her hand, and he seemed to understand our language because he hopped over to me and sat by my feet. All his injuries look like they have been healed thanks to Eve's medical treatment. Our drone here, also known as Fred, had but one purpose when it came to this planet. To blend in naturally with the creatures that lived on this planet and search the whereabouts of mutants. Eve, what are you saying? She's saying Fred's an alien, dude. Then, the mutants began to consume all the planet's natural resources and life forms, and the planet fell into a state of ruin. The mutants once invaded my home planet, too. Thanks to the help of some extraordinary people, we were able to hold on to our home, but the destruction was massive. That's when we developed something that could oppose the mutants, that were scattered throughout space, and rescued people on other planets at the same time. That would be none other than Sophia the Third here. Woohoo! A spacefaring tank! Yeah! There was also a project that set out to create a support bot that could perform maintenance and adjustments on Sophia. As for that support bot, well, that's actually an android. Model number Nora2057, Eve. In other words, that's me. She's a robot lady. Whoa, hold on just a minute. What are you... Are you saying that you got your memory back? Yeah, sorry that I didn't say anything about it until now. To be, well, to be fair, I didn't ask. No worries, Eve. But is everything that you just said really true? Uh, yeah, honestly, I'm not supposed to be telling you this. Excessive interaction with a planet's native life forms is forbidden. But since you saved me, I felt that you had the right to know. No, that's not it. I really just wanted to tell you everything. Oh god damn it, will you two just kiss already? I know she's a ro I know she's an android, but still. Eve. That didn't stop people in Dragon Ball, did it? Uh, thank you for fighting alongside me all this time, Jason. This is where we part ways. I have to continue this on my own. What do you mean? It's exactly as I said. You found Fred, so that means you accomplished what you came here to do. That's why there's no need to keep for you to keep putting yourself in danger, fighting against these mutants. Leave the rest of this to me. I want you to return to the surface. No way! But Jason, why? Chronic hero- Because he's got chronic hero syndrome. There's still a lot I don't get. If these mutants are aiming to destroy the Earth, I can't just walk away now. You don't have to worry. I will- Can one really do this all alone? Where's the guarantee in that? If you fail, do you have some other way to stop the mutants? I... Even if you don't think you're gonna fail, you should always eliminate any risks you can, right? You know what needs to happen in order to make... You know what needs to be done in order to make that happen. Eve, I... Want to be there for you. Just like you were there for me. It's my turn to support you, Eve. I held out my hand towards her. Jason, will you give me your support? Eve's hand joined together with mine. I held it as tightly as I could. And then she held tightly and crushed my hand. Because she's a goddamn android. Yeah, leave it to me. With one with one hand. Because she broke the other one. Yay, and we get the wall module. This in, in this particular iteration, you actually have to hold down a separate button in order to activate it. So you don't accidentally go on the floor or on the wall when you don't want to. Which is a big a big plus. And an improvement over the other one. So for now, we're going to get out of here. We're going to get to Area 7. 
Which you think is going to be an area two, but it's not. The entrance to that is actually an area three. Let's do that. Ah, so much backtracking. God damn. I mean, I know this is necessary, and the original had it too, but. Ugh. Whoop! Get out of the way. There we go. Yeah. There we go. Ah. So yeah, she's a robot. He's a scientist. She's a robot. You think the two of them can really make it work? I don't know. Romance, I don't I don't think romance was this writer's strong suit. <laughs> Uh, that's okay. You're not even... I mean, if you're playing this game, you're not playing it for, for the romance of Jason and Eve, you know? Yeah. Ah, I, I'm a little bit used to the 3DS controls when it comes to the wall module, because it's the same as your aiming button. In here, you have the, the uh, other button, the ZR button. So it's just the R button. Well, for, for default. Which is weird because the 3DS also has the, or at least the new 3DS, has the uh, ZL and ZR buttons, so... I don't know. Seems like it's a little unnecessary, is what I'm saying. Then again, not everybody has a new 3DS either, so... <laughs> they, they just die! Sure, why not? There we go. Hey! And down. Ah, more of you guys. And away we go. Oh, and on our way to Area 7, I do want to show a thing to you guys that that stumped me f until I was able to get the down the first bit of downloadable content. Which will be in area one if we can get up there. There we go. Thank you. Do, 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 do. ABS, always be saving. that. Thank you. Hello. Hello, boys. You think you can get me? Catch me if you can, assholes. <laughs> Whoa. Ow! You dick. So, yeah. If you go up here, you'll need the wall module for it, no matter what. Whee! I'm driving on the sea of land! So, yeah. For the longest time, this area right here stumped the hell out of me. I was like, I never knew what it was for. Why is this here? I don't know. But you play through his gun vault, there will be something here. So, there is something there, just not when you're playing as Jason. So, mystery solved! Yay! <laughs> it's nothing there for Jason, it's there for Gunvolt. Damn it. Whee! And whoop. Alright, wait, is my receiver on? No, you turned it on. Thank you. Hey, some bullshit! Wow, this is a longer video than I anticipated. Whoa, 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 whoa! Did not mean to do that. And... Oh! Any more? Didn't think so. 
Yeah, this video has gone on a lot longer, gone on significantly longer than the other ones so far. Holy shit. I think it's because of, like, all of the story and the backtracking that I had to do. I'm having to do in this one. Eh, there we go. Drive, 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 drive. Uh, the only thing about sitting here and doing a whole bunch of these videos at one time makes your ass hurt. <sighs> Come on, let's go. We're almost to Area 3. Come on! Now, oh, damn. Alright, here we go. Cool. Ah, just take the ceiling. I'll take the high road. Thank you. And down we go. Down we go. Too bad, the, yeah, too bad those don't stay closed when you leave the area and come back. Open, rather. I know what I mean. You know what I mean. I hope, right? Alright, there we go. And away we go. Ow! You little fucker. It's a good thing these can be climbed upon. Whee! I didn't even show this off earlier. Shit. <laughs> That's okay, though. <sighs> Area 7 getting hot in here. Looks like this data matches the information we have in Sophia's database. Jason, I just got confirmation. The one who's commanding all of these mutants, the mutant lord, is in the area after this one. Got it, thanks. Now we just gotta find a way to get out of this area, but yeah, there's probably a lot of mutants here. To make matters worse, looks like the mutants who left the glacier area made their way over to this one. No way! Do you think they anticipated that we're coming here? I want to say no way, but with the mutant lord being an intelligent creature, you never know. If that's the case, I doubt they're gonna just let us stroll on through. Alright, let's try to find the path of least resistance here. And saved! Whew! <laughs> the stealth level is what I'm calling this. Fiery stealth level. You'll see what I mean in the next video. Um, so, with that said, thank you guys for watching. I do hope you enjoyed it. Take care, everybody. And until next time, this is Gomer, the Ranting Thespian, signing off.